Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. How much baking soda does it take to raise pH? As per standard, 1.25 pounds of baking soda is enough to raise the pH level of a 10,000 gallon pool by 10 ppm. So to achieve a 100 ppm alkalinity, you would need 12.5 pounds of baking soda for a 100,000 gallon of pool water. What does baking soda do to pH? Baking soda, sodium bicarbonate, is used to raise alkalinity and also slightly raise pH. And soda ash, sodium carbonate, is used to raise pH and slightly raise alkalinity. For example, getting a pH reading around 7.2 to 7.6 in 10,000 gallons, 37,854 liters, of pool water would take roughly 21 pounds of baking soda. How much baking soda do I need to raise the pH in my pond? But, how much baking soda should you add to your pond to raise pH levels? As a rule of thumb, start with 1 teaspoon for every 10 gallons of pond water. And be sure to fill a bucket with your pond's water and dissolve the baking soda in the bucket. Does baking soda raise pool pH? Baking soda, also known as sodium bicarbonate is naturally alkaline, with a pH of 8. When you add baking soda to your pool water, you will raise both the pH and the alkalinity, improving stability and clarity. Many commercial pool products for raising alkalinity utilize baking soda as their main active ingredient. How do I aerate my pool to raise the pH? Simply doing things like pointing the returns upwards and running the pump on high to create surface disturbance will aerate the water reasonably well. One could also add an aerator to a standard return. If there are waterfalls, fountains, spillovers, etc., turning those on will also help. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. 